Welcome back to R&DW Adventures. I'm Daryl. And I'm Renee. And we've got another junk fooding for you today with uh, some inexpensive uh, high protein snacks. And kind of where this is coming from is we're coming into spring, summer. Trail it's actually food. spring already, but you know, we're coming into spring, summer and you, know, you kind of want some of that uh, stuff on the trail every so mm -hmm. often. So we're looking for some good cheap options and this stuff from uh, Sims is available at uh, Aldi's. Yes. And I'm assuming Sims is actually tied to Aldi's in some way. Don't really know. Not but sure. But this we'll is try. beef built a bit uh, built, built on. Hong, which I've never tried that I can recall. I don't and know what that means. And it comes in either. three different <laughs> flavors. I don't right. know either. But we've got the teriyaki, the smoked, and the original. And so I'm thinking we should try them in that reverse order. Right, I was just going to say. Okay, so original first. So we'll try the original first. I hope these don't look like dog biscuits. <laughs> and they do come with the uh, resealable bags. Like and that's the nice. Ziploc style bags. That's really nice. And just to let you know, one, there's about two servings, so and there's 16 grams of um, protein in half the bag. So if you ate the whole thing... So this is what it looks like. They're a little... Biscuit. What's biltong? I don't understand. Yeah, I'm not really sure. Looks very rough cut steak. Yeah. Okay. So, let's give it a shot. Mmm. Very chewy. Very dry. Mm-hmm. Stringy. Why? This feels like real string. I don't <laughs> want to know. Lucky. The flavor is pretty good, though. Mm-hmm. I don't like the texture, but the flavor is no. pretty good. Mm hmm Flavor is actually really good. Mm-hmm. I like the flavor a lot. I hate the texture. I hate it too. So I'm only going to give it a two and a half. I definitely would not buy it. Mm-mm. Again. So. I'll give it a three because it would serve its purpose. I'd keep it with our um. You're going to have to take a lot downstairs. of water. Yeah. I'd keep it with our emergency kit. For like when you're really hungry, or you know you really need food and you need to ration it, I would do that. So, let's move on to the uh, well, smoked flavor. Okay. Which I'm sure is going to be pretty much the uh, same thing. Oh, and these are like a little bit bigger chunks in this bag. You can actually see the fat from it on some mm -hmm. of them. Like, yeah. You taste the uh, smoky right away. And that's not a good thing. It's like bacon. Mmm. I mean, it's yeah. that smoky, like. But yeah, it's not good, in my opinion. I'm giving that's it only a two. That's only getting a one from me. I'll give it a two. It's got a slightly better texture, but it's still. I guess that's what biltong is. I'm guessing because it's so far. They have that in common. So, moving on to the uh, teriyaki. It looks gross. This doesn't have that like translucent look that uh, some of the others did. Oof. Definitely more pungent. Only in the smell. It doesn't taste like anything. I'm not tasting the uh, teriyaki. Me neither. I smelled it. There it is. I got it. Like right at the end. Mm -hmm. I don't like it. I'm giving this a one. It is better than the smoked. Mm. I don't think so. Not as good as the original. For sure. I'm going to give that one a two. I'm giving it a one. Well, the texture is worse on this, I think, it than really the others is. were. Again, this would be something I'd keep in the emergency kit, like where we keep that case of water when... If we really were desperate, yeah, I, would I don't eat think it. I don't think it's worth it. I mean, I, I would I wouldn't go out of my way to buy it. But no. if I had it, that's what. If somebody yeah, gave if, me this, that's what I would do. If we got it, you know, if it were on the shelf, mm -hmm. buy it. But no, mm -mm. not good. I don't recommend it. Any of them. Oh, unfortunately. But maybe you like the texture of biltong. Yeah. Well, and the thing I, I liked about this in concept <clears throat> was there are these tiny little bits. Right. So it's nice for, you know, Easier taking a few right. bits on the trail and not have like a 
whole beef jerky exactly stick and i liked that idea too and i like that you could reseal it like you could have a couple bites you could put it right. away you could have a couple in a little while when you want more but i really am it's no. not my thing mm -mm. unfortunate but yeah no. sad all right that's gonna wrap this up then so big don't buy yeah but please Check out our uh, channel icon over here so that you can see more videos that we've done and hit the little bell icon so that you can actually get the notifications when we go live or when a new video drops, which we do every Monday, Wednesday, Friday. But on this side, if you like this video, check that out because it's more junk fooding videos just like this.